At the top and bottom of leaves are tiny pores or openings called stomata. Stoma is the singular form of the word. The pink cells here that form the opening are called guard cells. When they swell up, the stomata open, and when they lose water, they close. This is very important for plants to avoid losing too much water. Water moves into the roots by osmosis and travels through tiny tubes or veins until it gets to every leaf. At this point, water can leave the leaves through the stomata. If the stomata are open and the sun is shining, transpiration, the movement of water through the plant, can happen quickly. If the stomata are closed, they will prevent water from leaving the plant. This can be useful on the hottest part of the day when the plant could lose too much water. But water is necessary for photosynthesis, which happens in the chloroplasts. The photosynthesis reaction happens in two parts, the light reaction and the dark reaction. The light reaction occurs in the thylakoid discs, which are stacked into grana, or granum in its singular form. The dark reaction occurs in the fluid portion called the stroma. Be careful, stroma and stoma sound a lot alike, but they're not the same thing. That little r makes quite a difference. Stoma or stomata are the pores in the leaves, and the stroma is the liquid where the dark reactions occur. Thanks for watching this episode of Teacher's Pet. Don't forget to like and subscribe and follow me on Twitter at SciencePet.